really fuck with me way back then, girl. How about now? Cause I'm up right now. And you stuck right now. Oh, you thought you had it all figured out back then, girl. How about now? Cause I'm up right now. Okay, I've just been on bed. That's why I look like I just. Okay, wait, 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 wait. So. Um, I've actually had a bottle of Jaeger in my fridge for months now. It's actually from the video I did with Odie. So this just proves that I'm not that much of an alcoholic, but I'm up there. So I just think I'm gonna have the last, this is probably like what? Two shots, three shots? Should I have this now? Should I? Should? I'm gonna wait for you guys' answer. Should I have it or not? Yeah, you guys said yeah? Always, always, let's go. <laughs> Disgusting! Disgusting! What is up, AT, and welcome or welcome back to my channel. I am coming at you yet again with that top tier content. I'm coming at you guys with yet again another vlog, okay? So, as you saw from the previous clips, I've been cleaning, doing my work. So, I was actually six lectures and one assignment behind the assignments on Monday. So, I was just really grinding the whole day. The reason why I'm behind, because y'all know I'm usually on top of things. It's because yesterday I decided to take a day off. I'm like, I'm actually not doing any work. I took a shower, changed into some fresh PJs and spent the whole day just doing what I want to do. Because I was like, like girl, your character was less than a week ago. And within that week, you've submitted one assignment. You've written one test. You've submitted, posted one vlog. You answer the second one, you deserve a day off. Okay, so I took a day off. That explains why I had so much work to catch up on today. But we're all good, we caught up. We're good, okay, we're good, we're good. So the plan for this vlog was to initially go to campus and study today. Not study, we'll complete my assignment. But um, my friend told me that campus is closed, so I'm like, let me just work in my apartment. But later this afternoon, it is okay, my watch is off. Why is my watch always off when I start the video? Right now, it's about half past three, and at five o'clock, we're meeting up with, by we, I mean my boyfriend and I, you guys know this by now. We are meeting up with Neo. Actually, they're gonna come here, and then we're gonna leave together for happy hour, because I am going to Devon on Wednesday, so this will be the last time I see Neo before my birthday weekend celebration. So we need to just touch bases, okay? Yeah, on Monday, my plan is to get vaxxed, because as I said, I'm going to Durban on Wednesday and I'll be spending like a week there and within that week I have so much to do so I'm just trying to get everything I can do now and just do it now. Did that make sense? I'm just trying to do everything I can do right now and then save the really really important things for later. Stay tuned for this vlog, it's gonna be cute as per usual, okay? Please don't forget to like, comment and subscribe child, I'm on the road to 20k. I'm really on the road to 20k so if you haven't subscribed go ahead and do that. I appreciate it and let's get right into the video. I don't know if you guys can see properly, but I still have a bit of a mark from the accident. Um, yeah, you guys could probably see that. And it's making me upset because it's been a week, okay? When will my eye be okay? Like, my eye is fine, it's just the actual mark. But now that I look at myself, I actually have bags under my eyes. I really just think I'm exhausted because I have gotten no rest since the accident um my parents did advise me to um send a letter to the uni and tell them listen your girl almost died okay but like one thing with the law faculty they don't really give a fuck and i knew that from the beginning so i just put on my big girl panties okay i just put on my big girl panties and i submitted everything i need to submit wrote what i need to write i'm almost sure that i got distinctions for both okay so that's been me. I posted a vlog for you guys. So I, I I really think I'm just tired. And that's why this just won't go away. But hopefully at home I get a bit of rest. Mm, doubt it. Also you guys. UCT did me so dirty. My birthday. My actual birthday. September 28th. I'm writing a test. Not just a small small test. I'm writing a property law test. It's not even at 8am so I can write and go live my best life. It's at 6pm. Which means I cannot live my best life before that. Which makes me sick to my stomach. Deal, 
but i do have a weekend planned for my birthday which is going to be that weekend so everything's going to be okay like you guys are going to get the content you deserve i'm going to enjoy my 22nd birthday but i'm just mad that on my actual birthday i'm writing like could you ever could you ever but it's okay no that's right <laughs> Why? <laughs> he wants to do his pose for, for YouTube. I. All the YouTube channels. He must chill. We are literally already here. The next day the screen protector off my phone and i am so nervous the name nerves because what if i drop my phone because i don't have another one on right now but let's pray to god that i don't drop my phone because in zokala i'll actually cry but this is what my old one is looking like guys do you see why you should get a screen protector because if i drop my phone without this curtains curtains child so it is about nine o'clock on a monday it's actually 909 to be exact and my plan today is to go to campus the law campus because i need to do some lectures for today and then finish my assignment which is due at 12 so i'm gonna go do that and then after that i want to go get vaxxed i didn't book an appointment because i heard you could just walk in so i hope it's not full or anything and then i've decided to just rest for the rest of the day after vaccine because i don't know how the vaccine will react to my body or how my body will react to the vaccine actually um what if i'm here hopping with a broken arm what if i don't feel anything you know i don't know i don't so that's why i've just decided to keep it cool for the rest of the day tomorrow i need to go run a few errands at cavendish i basically live at cavendish child um specifically i need to get vape flavor because i am flying home on wednesday and my chances of going to the mall when i'm at home are very slim because when i'm at home all i want to do is be in my bed right and then on wednesday obviously is my flight to durban so that's just the mo for the next like two days anyways that's enough talking let me go graft but before that do you guys see my skin do you guys actually see my skin sickening sis anyways let's go <laughs> mask and i only realized i forgot my mask when i got into the uber so now i'm running all the way back to my apartment i was wondering why is the air so fresh today candy i forgot my mask fuck okay bad start bad start
guys i'm so confused by campus weather because it's literally drizzling meanwhile the skies are normal that's suspicious That's weird. Like, doesn't look like it should be raining. But it is, so like, what the fuck? But anyway, chill. I'm with your face. Hey guys. No, dude, your skin is actually sickening. Is it sickening? No, sickening. Is it giving? She's doing all her work. <laughs> I'm just here to eat before I get vaxxed. We interrupt our program to bring you this important message. This video is proudly sponsored by Skillshare. Skillshare is an online learning community where you can explore new skills and immerse yourself in creativity. Skillshare offers thousands of stimulating classes for the creative and the curious. Class topics include financial management, productivity classes, music, and in-depth art classes, just to name a few that I'm personally interested in. As you guys know, I'm a full-time law student at UCT, so my academic schedule controls the rest of my life. When I find myself being unproductive and lazy, which is only natural sometimes, I tend to be hard on myself rather than optimizing the productivity that's already there. So I took a class by Vanessa Loder on how to maximize my productivity three times over. Vanessa actually graduated from an Ivy League university and has a truly impressive academic record. I had quite a few important takeaways from the class, but the most important thing that stood out to me was how Vanessa actually provided the weekly timetable she discussed during the class under her resources tag, free to use, which saves you ample time since you don't have to create your own timetable. The class was a short and sweet 28 minutes long, which I definitely appreciate because of the convenience. Classes on Skillshare are designed to fit your personal schedule and skill level, where most of the classes are under an hour and where members get unlimited access to their desired classes, as well as informative feedback from a community of millions. So, if you've been looking for a chance to finally explore a new hobby or intensify your skills and creativity in your spare time, this is it. The first 1,000 people to click the link in my description box will get a one month free trial of Skillshare Premium, so you can start tapping into your creativity and hobbies today. A massive thank you to Skillshare for providing such an amazing learning opportunity few moments later hey guys what's up so right now what is the time it is 13 28 i just had lunch on campus with Odie, and i had the greatest time ever it's always a good time with my girl so right now i am at the jammy stop waiting for a jammy going to forest hill because that's where the vaccination site is so i don't know if you can hear me there that's where the vaccination site is so i'm just gonna wait for the next 20 minutes for this jammy and yeah, that's pretty much what's up let me show you guys the i don't know if this is a lake or a dam it's okay i guess it's a dam like right next to campus My friend is here and we're about to be vexed. Vexed to whatever. <laughs> Vexed boys, worldwide. Babe. worldwide. 
Ooh, ooh. Okay. Love the forest. Uh -huh. That's good, is it? <laughs> <laughs> I literally just spoke for two minutes and the thing wasn't recording. Child, it is 15.23 and I just came back from the vaccination site. We are, oops, we are vaxxed girls worldwide, okay? And I'm not gonna lecture you guys and tell you guys to go vaccinate because I am a huge advocate of do whatever you want to do with your life and with your body. I really think you should vaccinate, but if you don't want to, that's completely fine. The vaccine was quick and painless. I am not afraid of needles, so it was, it could be anything but painless, okay? I have tattoos all over my arms. But anyway, shout out to UCT for creating such a quick and efficient vaccination site. I didn't even wait long. I, I think the whole process wasn't even longer than 30 minutes. And that includes the waiting, the vaccine, the registering, blah, blah, blah. So shout out to UCT, okay? I have my own qualms with UCT. But one thing about them, they are very quick and very efficient. Anyways, I was craving chicken pasta, but I forgot to defrost the chicken. So I'll probably just settle for something else for dinner. I'll talk to my boyfriend about that. Um... I'm really glad that I finished everything I wanted to do today. I submitted my assignment. I did my lectures for today. I saw my girl Odie. I saw my other friend Bule. And guys, I don't have a lot of friends. Okay, I don't think I have a lot of friends. So when I do see my friends, I'm just like... <laughs> I get so happy, okay? But my plan right now is to just rest. Take off my wig, take off my sneakers, take off Nje and just rest, okay? And I wanted to prepare the next wig for my yoga store. It is a body wave wig, really cute. But I'll see if I feel up to that later because I really just want to be lazy right now. I'm craving something like sweet. I just don't know what it is. I don't know if it's a McFlurry. So I'll just check on Uber Eats to see what dessert I can order. But if I do end up preparing the wig, I will insert the clips. One thing about me, you guys know I always insert clips, okay? That's just that I'm... <laughs> Something tells me I should start packing for my flights on Wednesday. But I'm just too lazy and I never pack this early so it doesn't make sense at all. So I'll just go back to my default um, desire which is just tourist. So I will catch you guys later on or tomorrow. It depends. Bye. <laughs> I recognize your fragrance, hold up, you ain't never gotta say shit, mm. and I know you taste this a little bit, mm, high maintenance, mm. everybody else basic, you live life on an everyday basis with poetic justice, poetic justice, if I told you that a flower bloomed in a dark room, would you trust it, I mean I write poems in these songs, dedicated to you when you're in the mood for empathy, it's blood in my pen, better yet with your friends and them, I really wanna know you all. I really wanna show you off. Fuck that. Pour up plenty of champagne. Cold nights when you curse this name. You called up your girlfriends and y'all curled in that little bitty range. I heard that. She wanna go and party. She wanna go and party. Nigga, don't approach her with that Atari. Nigga, that ain't good game, homie. Sorry. They say conversation. Rule a nation. I can tell. But I could never write my wrongs. Less I write it down for real. P.S. What's up, A team? Welcome to yet again another day of my vlog. So it's about okay, I don't know what the time is, but it's probably like three, half past three, and I've been doing my lectures the whole day. I've been preparing a sponsorship. So if there's any day where it's like, damn, you've really been balancing being a content creator and being a student, it is today because when our boyfriend gets home from campus, um, he was actually meant to take some brand photos of me, but then I just don't feel up to it anymore. I'm just tired, to be honest, so that's why I just... No. Anyway, I just um, went to Cavendish to get some vape flavor, and then I haven't eaten today. One thing about me, I won't eat. Like, it's a very bad habit, but if I'm busy, I just won't eat, and then I wonder why I feel sick, okay? So I got um, 10-piece nuggets and some chips, and obviously my Fanta Orange standard procedure. So yeah, I actually still have a lot to do because I need to pack. My flight is tomorrow, and I have not packed. But I'm thinking, since my flight is at like quarter to five, I can just pack in the morning. Like I'll have ample time to pack and do my lectures for tomorrow. So yeah, that's what I'm about today. And yo, guys, one thing about this vaccine, my arm is so sore. Like my arm, it is sore. 
down like damn every time i bump my arm against like something i'm always like shit like what's going on so yeah that's the only side effect i think i'm really feeling i do feel a bit nauseous but that could be because i haven't eaten and it's like three o'clock so it could be that i actually also wanted to go to the garden in my apartment complex but it's a bit chilly outside so i'll probably go tomorrow morning which is actually perfect timing because i love being in connection with the universe and with nature um so it being a last day in Cape Town tomorrow for the next week or so, perfect. Like, perfect time to go to the garden and just be one, okay? Be one with nature and speak to the man above. But yeah, that's what I'm about today. And I'll probably catch you guys later or tomorrow. Hope you guys are enjoying the vlog this far. Please, oh, my arm, child. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already because what are you waiting for? Anyway, child. Also, I was meant to buy my screen protector today. But then I don't feel like spending my own money on it, so I'll just make my dad buy it for me when I get home. So. Ha! Gotti! Ha! Gotti! That's that. I also cannot drop my phone until then because the screen will crack. I do have a shatterproof cover on, but you never know. Like sometimes the screen might crack when I heal it. Vela odds, vela odds, you know? So. Yeah, that's why I didn't get a screen protector today because my dad should buy it. Can I do what our parents for? Anyway, child. What is up, A team? I am at the airport. It is what is the time? It is 15:11, and I board in like an hour. So I just decided to come to Megan Bean and grab a drink and some food. Um, one thing about me, you guys, I look crazy today. So I'm carrying this huge ass teddy bear. And okay, quick story time about the teddy bear. So I always tell my boyfriend to never get me a stuffed animal. I feel like every single time someone gives me a stuffed animal, the relationship just crumbles. Okay. So my ex, which is I don't even regard him as an ex, honestly, it's been over two years. It's expired now. The relationship is done. I don't know who this man is. I mean, he could be walking down the street. I wouldn't. I wouldn't know a thing. Sorry to this man. It's done. Okay, it's done. So, in fact, I don't have any exes. I've only dated one man, and that's my boyfriend. Anyway, child. So, a guy I used to know gave me the teddy bear. And it's just been in and out of storage, just wasting space in my apartment. So, I decided I'll give it to my nephew because he'll probably appreciate the teddy bear more. One thing about me, I don't associate gifts with people that gave it to me. So, I'm okay with giving the bear to my nephew. I don't not sentimental to me or anything so i hope you'll appreciate it i hope you'll look back at, the, at this video and be like yes my aunt really writes me because nothing actually like kind of and people are asking me oh is that bear for you and i'm like no <laughs> no anyway child i'm just waiting on my food this is what my drink looks like it's not alcoholic by the way i almost ordered an alcoholic drink but i'm like my like my stomach is empty right now i couldn't need to drink alcohol so yeah that's me. Everything here is absolutely atrocious. I look like a rat, but you know what? It's okay. It's okay. I'll show you guys the bear when there aren't people sitting behind it. Because not to look like I'm seeing a video of them and I'm not. And ironically, they're the ones that ask me about the bear. So like, no. So I'll show you guys the bear when I get up from Megan Bean. <laughs> but I'm just finding it so funny. Like, hella funny. Because it's just like, 
this is so bizarre. Anyways, <laughs> any man who says they dated me, Banaman, they lying. <laughs> Hi mother, yeah. how are you? <laughs> The next day. Good morning, my beautiful A team members. It is about 9:37. I have a touch at 10 that I don't know what's going on, and like I do not know what's going on in property. This is so humiliating. This is so humiliating. <laughs> no, on the real though. But anyway, I actually just wanted to end off the vlog. It is a rainy day in Durban, which I fully am here for. I love rain. I don't know if you can hear it. My room is like next to the carport, so I can just hear the raindrops. Drops up. But yeah, thank you guys so much for tuning into this vlog. By the way, my nephew loves the bear, so it is worth carrying it around the airport looking like a thangya, okay? Anyways, thank you guys so much for tuning into this vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed. You've been asking me for a long vlog, so I hope you watch the entire vlog. Please don't forget to like and drop your comments. I love reading you guys' comments. Also, if you haven't subscribed, why haven't you subscribed why why anyways i'll catch you guys in my next video thank you so much for tuning in love you guys and i'll catch you guys in my next video bye why is my dad why are you being noisy because i'm up right now and you're stuck right now oh you thought you had it all figured out back in girl how about now because i'm up right now and you're stuck right now